Hi everyone, it's Lynn. Welcome to my crafty corner. And today we're going to be doing a VW fold, unfold card or WV, whichever. We, I'm just getting my measurements out. Sorry, everything's just slid off. There, that's better. Right, so WV or VW fold card. And um, I saw this by Laura Stranks at Creative Gems. So, and uh, she's from um, Australia, I think she's from. So, I've done it in pink and I've got a base that is 11 by 5.5. Pull it out a bit. So, it's 11 by 5.5 and, and I've scored it at 1 3 quarters, 3.5, three 5 and a quarter, and 7. So, it's 1 and 3 quarters, 3.5. Three five and a quarter and seven and the first fold is a mountain and a valley mountain and a valley so it's going to fold up like that bone folder and i'm just gonna just do the folds burnish them on that one so that's the back or the main bit and then the V, yeah this is a V, um, this is um, 6 by 3 and it is um, but, uh, scored at 3, so 6 by 3 and scored at 3. There, put those to one side and now uh, we've got lots of bits. So we've got a mat for the back and this is five and one eighth by three and a half. So five and one eighth by three and a half. And we're just gonna pop that on there. And then a white piece, which is four and seven eighths by three and a quarter. So we'll pop those on. Might as well do it as we're going along. on here and the white so you can stick a sentiment on this white and write on it right so that's that Okay, and now I've got, we'll do the back, the big back card first. I mean, you know, this bit, the W fold one first. Because that's a W. So I've got some mats, four of each in the pink again. And these all measure five and one eighths by one and three eighths. And then I've got some paper which is um, four and seven eighths by one and one eighth. So these are all um, a stamping up paper pad, which I've put away. I don't know where it is. So, right, we're just going to mount these on that. Try and get it straight then. Let's do all four. The birds outside a minute ago chirping away now they've gone really quiet 
at the moment there's a bit of sunshine it's windy but i can see there's a big dark gray cloud on its way so no doubt it'll rain again I think I cut this before I got my new uh, guillotine, so that's why it's a bit fray on the edges. <clears throat> okay. Oh, just, these are all going to go on here. And it, well, yeah, they're all over this, so it's not really a directional paper. No matter which way you put it up, there's some upside down. So don't forget if it's a directional one to put it the right way around. There we go. Quite thick this pink card. You could do each panel in a different paper if you wanted. It's totally up to yourselves. Up to your imagination. Right, so that's that. Now we'll do the V. So, and we're putting that bit that way around. We're not doing it like you would a normal card. We're doing it that way. Okay. So we'll just, I've got a little flower cut out to use on the inside. I'm going to cut the edge off so it's going off the edge. So I've got two pink mats and two, and these are, these are two and three quarters by two and three quarters. And the paper is two and a half by two and a half. So, I'll always put that on there. It looks more complicated than it is, this card. We need to go for ease and impact. <laughs> Seems to be a bit bigger, that one. Anyway. And then we're just going to pop these on. Beautiful paper. <clears throat> Let's see if I can find it so I can tell you what it's called. Oh, I should be able to find it because it's here. Ah, there it is. It is called, uh, let me pull it out so I can actually read it, not that one, here we go, it is called Delightful Floral, Delightful Floral is the name of this paper. And it's beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. There we go. So that's your little V card. And what we're going to do is we're going to glue it onto there like that. 
Right, I'm going to do it in line with that pink there. So I'm going to glue this bit first. You can't see me, can you? No. I've just put a little bit of glue on the inside of there. Sorry. Just on the inside of that bit. And then we'll turn it over and put a little bit of glue on the inside of this bit. Just hold that for a rolly mo. And there's your, your card base. Ta -da! And now this one, I am just going to cut it straight off. And then pop that there. Just all that, that way. Just as a bit of decoration for the inside. That. And then we'll use this other bit. We'll do it up there. Just go down a bit. There we go. Now you can stamp a sentiment in there. And then what I've got for the front is some vellum. So I'm going to put that on there in the middle. But first of all, I'm going to put this birthday wishes on. Um, die cut. Come on out, you come. And the wishes. Throw the little bits away. And yes, I didn't put the tape thing on the back. No, it's birthday wishes, not happy birthday, you dipstick. Oh, no. <laughs> Silly Billy. Could have had wishes birthday, couldn't I? Let's see if we've managed to save the day. And then that's going to go on there. So we'll just put a bit of glue on the back of where the wording is. Just to hold the vellum down. Disaster averted. Mm. 
Might as well stamp it while I'm here. Um, should we go pink or should we go black? We'll go black. Oh, it's already out in my black. So it should be. Birthday wishes and I'll go with my usual stamp set because I had it there. Is it that one? I don't know, I'll use that one. Enjoy your special day. Or oh, wishing you a wonderful day. Wishing you a wonderful day. I'll go with that one. Wishing you a wonderful day. Hey, hey, hey. I need a block, which I should have got out already, but I didn't. This is losing its stick a bit. I have to put some of my special glue on it. Yeah. Come on. Come on. How cute. So I just used a punch to punch out these. There we go. Beautiful. If I say so myself. So that's today's card, a VW card. So you got your V and you got your W and it comes together like that. Thank you for watching. If you've liked what you've seen, please give me a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe and hit the uh, notification bell and also share with your friends if you'd like to. Ta -da. And you too could be making a card like this. <laughs> Thank you again for watching. Take care of yourself and your loved ones and I'll see you next time.